and welcome to Spirit Forest. It is October 26th and Kyla and I are we're getting a hike in before the snowstorm hits. We're expecting a big snowstorm tomorrow. It's supposed to drop about 12 inches of snow at Spirit Forest and about 8 inches here. And if you see, there is already snow. Um, yep, I think it's going to be one of those winters again. I'm kind of popping this video in, so it's not really in order. Um, but I wanted to do a hiking video. <laughs> and I have some new kickers. If you noticed at the beginning of the video, I was showing off my new shoes. So let me just talk about those really fast. <sighs> Here I am wearing a jacket. And Kyla's wearing a jacket and fleece. And this guy over here is half naked. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to show off these shoes. These are, let me see, um, Want Do, W A N T D O. And Kyla, I'm going to have you hold the camera really fast, so just kind of keep it steady. You need two hands to hold that. Okay, oh, there we go. Okay, I just want to show off some of these about the shoe and what I like about it. First of all, if you're like me and you're on a budget, um, hiking shoes cost anywhere from like $100 to like $200. That's usually what I spend on hiking shoes. Um, these shoes are $75 and if you go onto their Facebook, and I'll put everything in the description below, if you go onto their Facebook and you comment or you post or you do something on their Facebook page, you try to keep that steady. Um, if you try to do something on their Facebook page, then um, you get $10 off. So then it's really like $65 for these shoes. So if you haven't checked out my video with Kyla as well, when we were talking about my hiking shoes, I'm a little bit of a hiking shoe snob and I have a ton of hiking shoes. Um, so I know about hiking shoes. That's what I'm trying to tell you is that I have bought top brand name hiking shoes and I've also bought some cheap hiking shoes. Um, these, I've, this is not the first time hiking in these shoes. Um, I did want to hike in it a few more. Look at, I still have not tag on it though. Um, I wanted to hike on it a little bit more before I give you guys kind of a review on these shoes. Um, I really like them. I really do. And like I said, for $65, I think these are just as good as my, um, some of my really high brand um, hiking shoes that I've hiked um, through the Grand Canyon in and uh, I would recommend these. Um, what I like about it is that it's it's waterproof so you can see that the the tongue is kind of more attached so it doesn't come all the way um, all the way off here. It also has this um, what's it called the Vibram um, footing I know you can see it now it's all muddy it's really muddy out here today and uh, so, it, but it's this sole is like strong. The only thing is that the, the shoe is a little bit heavy, but other than that, I think it's pretty good. I've got a nice toe kick on here, which a lot of times you need that, especially here in Colorado with all our rocks here. You've got a nice toe kick on here. Um, one of the things it doesn't have is that it doesn't have any way for me to put some crampons on it. You know, just like little, little ones for like if it's really icy in the trail because it's going to become icy pretty soon. So these aren't really good for the winter time but I think they're pretty good for um, probably spring and fall they do seem a little warm which is good for me right now um, but maybe in the summertime they might be a little bit too warm would be um, a review I have has a nice little nice little holder in the in the back side of the shoe too um, I really like them in fact I think you're gonna be seeing these in a lot of my videos um, I've been wearing them for probably like three weeks now or so or two weeks something like that as soon as I got them I immediately opened the bag and put them on um, I don't review a lot of product I get probably asked um, maybe every every other day now to review a product and um, when they asked me I was like ah, I'll just click on it you know see what they got and uh, I like the look of them too you know hey Rox stay here Rox you're staying here sorry yeah okay buddy stay here we're hanging out rocky wants to go back hiking okay so that's my review on the shoe um totally can you move buddy here here go, go with that way okay that's my review on the shoe i totally recommend the shoe um 
it's uh, Wadu, want do is what it's called. Um, really, again, really like the shoe. So, okay, let's get back to hiking. What's your shoes doing? Good. I only have like this part right here that got really dirty. Yeah. And my socks because I keep rubbing my foot against my sock. Yeah. It's dirty. It's muddy. It's messy. It's probably like my limit of what I hike in. Um, but I knew that we're getting this other snowstorm and it's supposed to be a really big one and I probably it won't dry for another week so I just wanted to be able to get this hike in too and talk to you guys if you saw my last video which was a premiere I want to thank you guys for showing up that's a lot of fun it's so fun to chat with you you know while my video premieres and you guys have been all so nice I haven't I didn't have to delete any messages at all everyone was really nice and and uh, I really have built a great community here at Spirit Forest so for those of you that were on the chat and who have commented afterwards I want to thank you for that that was a lot of fun it was a little different trying to do a live video at Spirit Forest even though it was pre-recorded <laughs> um, maybe one of these days I'll get internet out there and I'll be able to do a real real live video out there and um, be able to chat with you I think that would be great um, so there's some things I want to talk about. There's a, uh, I have some, uh, so again, this video is, is recent. This is, uh, this happened Saturday. So I'm going to be sneaking some of these videos in because I shot a lot of videos because I have been out of town um, for a long time. Um, actually, most of the month of October, I've been out of town. I just got back recently from a trip in uh, Las Vegas that I want to show you some little clips of. So check this out.
people watching spot ever. Just sit here for a good like 30 minutes watching people. This is with all the little different. I think it's. I think that looks really cool. I really do. I think it looks awesome. They have all these little details here in Vegas. That you just don't see anywhere else. So they take these little boats around, and they have somebody singing it. So you see that guy over there. So a lot of times they sing while people are in the boat. So I told Vanessa and I found her job. So I do like Vegas. Vegas is a lot of fun. I went there a lot when my 20 or my 30s actually is when I first went to Vegas and it was just kind of fun to pretend you're young again. You know, my my babies were were very young, so it was kind of nice just to go there and get out in the open. Um I have some hikers over here in case you see these ladies. Um yeah, so um it was it was a lot of fun, but you know, the now I'm in my mid 40s and it's not as fun anymore you know like i was ready to leave it was too many people too many crowds um i'd rather not be in the city anymore and i'd rather be in the wilderness and so when i travel to some places a lot of times i just i just have to be in nature you know because that's just who i am so i do try to plan some hiking trips or something as I visit um, cities either for work or um, sometimes vacation so you are gonna see that too because um, I'm gonna be filming as I travel to a lot of places too and uh, and I have filmed some of it already so I um, hope you'll look forward to that Sorry, there's just a lot of hikers coming by this is a really popular trail I mean we're right next to the foothills um, but if I drove any more in the mountains I'd have to I'd have to get some crampons and I don't have any crampons for Kyla and she doesn't even have any hiking shoes that can take crampons so um, more gear to buy <laughs> always buying more gear part of me like doesn't want to buy her any like really nice boots yet because she's growing like crazy so as soon as I buy it the next year I'm gonna have to buy it again but I don't know Kyla I don't know if you're gonna get any really cool hiking boots yet <laughs> She's, she's over here kind of waiting for me, um, so I'm going to get going here soon. Um, I do want to tell you guys that I did some new designs, some new shirt designs for Spirit Forest. So, um, and there's some new products that they're offering too. They have um, a mug, like, like a glass mug or something like that. There's some other things too, and I'm going to try to keep adding to my uh, merchandise stuff so um, the, a lot of the proceeds go to Wilderness on Wheels and now I'm starting to raise money for the 2020 weird to say that uh, 2020 donation to Wilderness on Wheels so if you don't have a Spirit Forest shirt yet please go on to spiritforestbear.com and you don't have to get a shirt to actually I have bandanas I have coffee mugs I have what else is on there, Kyla? Buttons. I got buttons on there. Um, there's a certain percentage that comes to me, and then I use that again for my donations. So I appreciate any of those um, 
any of those donations that uh, or if you want to donate directly to Wilderness on Wheels you're welcome to do that as well and that's wildernessonwheels.org and my website is spiritforestbear.com where you can see all the stuff that I have for sale and I have a new Viking shirt I'm so excited I have a new Viking design um, it has the words say spirit forest on it and then I am going to design a well I designed it already but I'm actually gonna build it I'm gonna build a Viking shield <laughs> No idea what I'm gonna do with the shield <laughs> and why I need a shield, but I'm gonna be I'm gonna um, I'm gonna build a shield a Viking shield um, Maybe this winter or early spring. I don't know yet, but stay tuned for that But you could see the design it's on the shirt. It's on the shirt and of course it has a bear on it and then um, I have another one that's a heart and it shows like all the things that like I love and a lot of things that are on my channel. Um, and you and it has like limited colors on that one. And then I have a bear with a backpack that's hiking up a mountain. Um, so check that one out too. It's, it's, it's kind of fun. It's more cartoony like, you know, but I wanted to kind of change it up. I want my designs to look a little bit different. So um, hopefully you like those. And um, we're gonna continue to hike um, in this mud. My shoes are doing awesome. Love these shoes. I will be hiking in them again. I recommend these. Again, you can get them for $65. In fact, I might buy Kyla these shoes. That's a good idea. I might buy you these shoes. They're pink. They're pink. Yeah. Yeah, they're pink. I might get Kyla $65. Because you don't really have any hiking shoes. No, I have my running shoes. Yeah, she has her, she's, she's in running shoes right now pink of course okay anyways I'm rambling sorry not editing these videos you want the real thing <laughs> okay let's go hiking still because we're actually now in a loop and we're working our way back to the car oh one thing before I leave I have a video that's gonna be posted in mid-november I don't remember the exact date um, but I'll put it here mark that in your calendar it's gonna be another premiere and I have a huge announcement to make so you don't want to miss that one and it'll be a premiere probably posting at six o'clock mountain time and uh big big changes so stay tuned for that video So we're gonna end this video. We're getting towards the trailhead right now. This is a great trail for kids and families um, near Denver, Colorado. It is uh, called, I think it's the Red Rocks Trail, but I had it at the beginning of the video too. You can kind of check that out. They have a lot of little trails through here. Again, I consider this an easy trail. Maybe not so much when there's a lot of mud everywhere because we were sliding all over the place. But uh, if you're in this area, this is a nice trail just to, to go for a little nice um, nice hike. Better in the fall and the spring than in the summer. Summertime, it gets pretty hot over here. So um, anyways, thanks for joining me today. And I hope to see you on my next video, which we'll be posting on Halloween. And yes, I am in costume on that video. And I kind of act out. Of course, I'm a Viking. <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys Thursday. Bye-bye.